What's up? Oh my gosh. monstrosities we deal with because we don't have a cake cutter. Grant met his twin. I'm getting so annoyed. We just had another fire alarm fiasco. So my building is like a nice complex. I don't know if you can see behind me, but down below we have businesses and restaurants and stuff. And so one of them is being built and I guess or at least what management keeps emailing is that sometimes they accidentally trigger the alarm or whatever or testing it and then the alarm goes off but this is happening more and more and it's getting so annoying because it freaks Grant out it freaks out every single so Lily and I are going to the movies in a little bit we're gonna see Coco which looks really good we are both really excited to go see it oh hey what's up oh my gosh I'm on my balcony filming and then I see Adam vlogging. So Lily also. totally heard me vlogging and started copying me. Whatever. Anyways, I have to make a quick target run before we head to the movies. He's probably talking about the same thing I'm talking about, but it's annoying because it freaks Grant out. It freaks every dog in the building out. It freaks out the owners. And then I'm wondering, are any of these alarms ever real? And what happens if it is real and I happen to not be home. Like, can my building just not get this fire alarm thing settled? Because it's really disruptive, especially when it goes off at 6 a.m. I like to sleep, okay? Imagine if this was our first date and I got you P. Terry's. Do you wanna know what this is? What? Three years and five months date. That's what this is. A day late though. That's even worse! <laughs> Well, how was the movie? It was good. I didn't cry though. Yeah, there weren't as many sad parts as I was expecting. Did you cry? No. It's very funny. On a scale of 1 to 10, what would you give it? I would give it... 8. Hey, you copied me. Now it's gonna look like I copied you. You always copy me. I would also give it an Evidence 8. Evidence, best. Zero, 2. The Expender. Oh God. Time for the big reveal! Oh man. Is it gonna fit? Oh, that's there. a good question. We're gonna make it fit. I can't tell if this is a really big TV or just really big in a studio apartment. So, got the new TV up and running, but I'm trying to get this plastic off. Of course, I can't remember our Netflix login, so I can't utilize all of the features of the Roku TV, but I do still have Chromecast, so I can just cast it until I get the login credentials. I don't know why this happens, but I have all of the correct passwords written down and everything. And I don't know if it's like a connection glitch or something, but sometimes I try to log in and it will not let me, no matter what. Is this an issue that you guys have? I don't know. Does this TV look ridiculously large on my dresser? Maybe. I don't really care. I can finally see it from my bed. Lily and I are about to take our smoothie game to a whole new level. Oh yeah. This is really heavy. Yeah, it's a heavy duty blender. This would be great for the coffee shop we open up in like 10 years. Ooh! Ooh, so many different buttons with no labels. Alright, $16 blender Lily and I found randomly at Target. You did a good job, and we will always remember you. But it was time for an upgrade. This thing is so legit. 
We have settings for cake mixes, mixed drinks, smoothies, ice creams, whole juices, and hot foods. That I think is just a pulse thing. I don't know what these do. And there's like an LED screen here and I'm not sure what that's for. But this thing is legit. Lily and I are gonna be smoothie masters. So we're off to the vet again because Grant's not doing much better. And so instead of going to the 24 hour emergency vet, we're gonna go to our usual vet because they always seem to know what to do. Yeah, they're really good. And hopefully this will be the end of cleaning up Grant's puke. Turn left. Treating ourselves with some torchies tonight. Isn't that such an attractive taco? This is called the Republican, which is a hot dog on a tortilla instead of a bun. 